Guys, before we get started in the video today, please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button, or this will be in your bed later tonight. I'm not taking any chances. I'm going to hit that subscribe button and like. All right, now let's get to the video. Hey guys, Fulton here, and I'm back with another video for today, and in today's video, it is getting actually crazy. The biggest Bed Wars update happened today, and it happened three hours later. Like, what are they doing, bro? I swear, the Roblox Bed Wars people are just picking their nose up over there. But I'll give them the benefit of the doubt. This update is actually insane. We have a battle pass. And of course, you already know Fulton did buy the battle pass. But you already know what is my baby. I announce it in every video. The Grim Reaper is always my baby. So let's just take a review of the battle pass. So when you spawn in, it already looks different. It has the battle pass symbol up here. It's looking pretty cool. We still got the 30v30. We got the Bed Wars solos. And I'm going to skip over here because this is the actual new part. We got the doubles and the squads. So let's go over to where you guys actually care about. We have Jade, Raven, Pyro, Book, Beekeeper, Beatrix, and Warrior. These kits look absolutely sick. So if you guys want to know how to get these, you need to buy the Battle Pass, which is kind of actually expensive. It's around 800 Robux. I did fortunately get to buy it so that I am going to be able to get to show you guys the characters. So let's hop right into the Battle Pass. So as soon as you click on the Battle Pass, you get, you know, basically the Battle Pass, how every game does, just like Fortnite, basically. So right now I'm level three. I've been trying to level up so that I am going to be able to get the first kit and just review all the kits early. So right here we have the Free Pass and we have the Battle Pass. So up top, everybody gets this stuff. You're going to get stickers and you're actually going to get some free kits, which I think is actually pretty cool. So we have the Cletus Carrot, which is a spray, which is actually pretty cool. And then we have the Update Hype title, <laughs> the Bot title, um, you know, you guys can over here scroll for yourselves but i'm here for the kits so for the first kit that you get you unlock it at level 10 and it's a battle pass kit it is pretty cool so let's go ahead and review this kit so for this kit you get armor which is slightly cheaper and you can buy powerful warrior armor this is just giving me some of like uh what's it called some um this is giving me some Elder Tree vibes. This is basically another Elder Tree, so it's nothing too special to me. All right, back to the Battle Pass. So that's the first kit everybody gets. Not everybody, but for the Battle Pass holders. The next kit is the Beekeeper Kit. I actually have not reviewed this, so this is going to be my first time. So let's get right into it. So you catch bees around the map to upgrade your beehive. Upgrading your beehive will return additional iron and emeralds. Oh. So it gets you iron and emeralds. That's actually pretty cool. Honestly, I don't know if I see myself using it because it's just getting resources for you. And you know, Fulton, <laughs> I'm always getting kills, so I get my own resources. But yeah, it's, that is not a bad kit. It's pretty creative and I'm liking it. So the next kit after Beatrix is Jade. And this is actually the free kit. This is the first free kit Bed Wars has ever released. So let's get right into it. So Jade, knock people up with your giant hammer. I don't even have to review that. What is that? It took no time into thinking about that. So you get a big hammer and you can just hit people with it? I'm sorry, guys, but the free kit is probably not it. I mean, if you have zero kits, might as well use it. But I personally probably will never use Jade. And after Jade, we have the Raven. This is what was leaked and what I showed in my previous video. So let's take a look into this. Let's see if my prediction was right. Buy Ravens and fly at enemies to deliver deadly doses of poison. Oh my gosh, that's actually pretty good. Um, my prediction was wrong. I thought you were going to be able to use the bird as a camera, but it drops poison on it. And I wonder how much damage it is going to be able to do. So I can see myself using the Raven. And for the last one, we have the Pyro Kit. This is level 50. This is the creme of the creme. The icing on the top. The cherry on the bottom. I think I said that the wrong way. But anyways, let's review this kit. So Pyro, use your flamethrower to spray fire, making enemies brittle and taking more damage from attacks. Killing brittle enemies gives ember, which you can use to upgrade your flamethrower. Now that is a kit I will definitely be using. That sounds kind of OP, not gonna lie. I wonder how powerful the flamethrower is going to get because if it gets super powerful, this is going to be an OP kit. But anyways, guys, that is the battle pass. This is pretty good. This is a huge update for bed. What the heck? <laughs> okay, anyways, that is the battle pass. This is a sick update, huge update. So I'll give them the benefit of the doubt for updating it like two hours later. But yeah, guys, leave in the comments if you did happen to pick up the battle pass. And also, which kit is your favorite kit out of all these? Mine is pos probably the Raven and the Pyro. So yeah, guys, I don't know about you guys, but I'm going to be playing the level up so I can unlock these kits and get some gameplay for you guys. So yeah, I hope you did enjoy the video. If you did, please don't forget that like and subscribe, guys. And I'm Fulton, and I'm out. Oh, no. Oh, no.